Welcome back. It's countdown to liftoff. Blue Origin's new Shepard space capsule will launch from Texas tomorrow. The flight is just 11 minutes and it's going to go 60 miles above Earth's surface. On board with Jeff Bezos will be the youngest and the oldest space travelers ever. And right now, the launch is a go. As you can see the social media wall behind me, when this trip was announced, Bezos was going to be the first billionaire to blast off, but Richard Branson jumped ahead when he went into space last week. But you can see right there, Blue Origin just tweeting out that it is a go right now. They have all the time and specs behind me here. And Fox 35's Alina Shirazi joins us live with more on that story this evening. So, Alina, the space race turning into a bit of a billionaire's battle, it seems. Right, well, this a billionaire battle space race is unfolding rather quickly, just nine days after Richard Branson's flight. Jeff Bezos is preparing for his own flight to space tomorrow morning. To all you kids down there, I was once a child with a dream, looking up to the stars. It's the gift that keeps on giving, an ambitious dream turned to reality. And three main players are writing their names in the stars. SpaceX CEO Elon Musk busy building rockets and paving the way for space exploration. Virgin Galactic CEO Richard Branson is focusing on space flight. About a week ago, he successfully flew up 53 miles into space and back safely. If we can do this, just imagine what you can do. Now, another billionaire is preparing for his big moment. Jeff Bezos's Blue Origin flight is less than 24 hours away. What Branson has is a space plane that is dropped from a carrier aircraft at about 45,000 feet, fires its engines, and then goes to the edge of space up to, they went to about 53 miles. Bezos has a completely different system. He's got a more traditional rocket. And that's a rocket and a capsule. And right now he is scheduled to go um, tomorrow morning, Tuesday morning. And we have lift up. Uh, from West Texas. And uh, it's a rocket, goes up nearly 60 miles, and then the capsule separates. It continues on to the edge of space. Blue Origin's New Shepard, a small suborbital rocket, will take off vertically from a launch pad, going 62 miles into space, giving a shorter but higher speed journey than Branson's space plane. And while Branson made history as the first billionaire into space, Bezos's flight would be the world's first unpiloted trip to the edge of space with an all civilian crew. Both are designed to take paid passengers more than dozens of miles above the Earth's surface to experience a few moments of weightlessness and see the planet they live on from a bird's eye view. All of these billionaires are investing their own money and they're bringing this, the cost of access to space down and that means we can do more exploration and more research. And all eyes will be on Bezos' flight tomorrow. They could make history with both the oldest and the youngest person to ever go to space. For now, we're live on the Space Coast. Alina Shirazi, Fox 35 News.